Bismillahirrahmanirrahim. Hello guys, welcome to my channel. This is part 18 of our Android Studio tutorial series. In this part, we will learn about uh, Pinch Zoom Text View in Android. I have opened this uh, example app in which I have already created a Pinch Zoom Text View. Now, if I pinch, uh, pinch this uh, Hello World on my real device, it zooms and if I pinch it again to zoom it out it zoom outs so we will be creating a similar app like this in which we will be zooming in and zooming out the text view so let's start I've created this um, uh, empty project now I will go to this uh, uh, activity man.xml and I will uh, create uh, this text view and I will change the text to a hello to every one now I will come here and change the ID to txt underscore zoom now I will go to main activity Java file and here at the top I will create a text view Java text view and I will call this zoom text view semicolon now I will access the XML text view and uh, attach it to this Java text view Text zoom. Now the, we have attached this. Now I will implement the on touch listener. Implements on touch listener. Now I will implement the method in on touch listener, which is on touch. Now here I will create a method and get distance and it will take a parameter motion event motion event. Now in this method we will uh, track the motion of uh, the x uh, along the x axis and the y axis uh, so first i will track the x axis so for that i will use and dx is equal to motion event dot get x it will be tracked from zero minus motion event dot get x up to one one now I will enclose these two in brackets and put semicolon here and now I will cause it to an integer Now I will do the same for the for tracking the motion along y axis. So I will copy this and paste it right here and I will make this dy and this will be changed to y and this will also be changed to y. Now I will use some maths calculation on this and then I will return the integer value from this. Now I will use maths square root dx 
n to dx plus dy n to dy. Now we'll enclose this n brackets. I will put semicolon and now I will cost it into integer and I will return this. Now we will be using this uh, and the, the, the value of this get distance in uh, untouch method. But I will leave this untouch method here and I will create a new untouch method. I will copy this. Now I will paste it at the top and I will remove this. This view and only leave this motion event. Now I will code, write uh, some code inside this method. Now first I will check the pointer counts that if a, the finger used are two or not, uh, are not Get point account is equal to equal to two if two fingers are used because pinching can be done with two fingers. Then get the action and action event dot get action semicolon. Now we will get power action and Ever action is equal to action and event dot get action must semicolon not this action actually it will be motion event dot action mask semicolon enter now we will check this uh, power action if power action is equal to equal to motion e1 dot pointer action pointer down then do what then get the distance so for distance we will first create a variable here and m base base distance semicolon so m Base distance is equal to uh, get distance, and here we will pass motion event, which is event. Now, now we will create a float variable float m ratio is equal to. 1.0f 1.0f semicolon and now we will create float m dash ratio semicolon and now here we will use m dash ratio is equal to m a ratio semicolon now we will create final static uh, float 
step is equal to 200 semicolon now the a part of the this is uh, finished now we will use else if now and if uh, float delta is equal to we have get distance event minus m base distance m base distance divided by step semicolon I will put this and enclose this one thing one mistake I will cut this control X and I will put it here control V now we will take the square of this uh, delta so I will say float multi is equal to math dot p power 2 comma delta and semicolon and I will Put enclose this in brackets. Here it will start, and I will make this float. Float. O A. O A T. Float, and now I will use bracket here as well as here now m ratio will be equal to math dot m i n n and here i will pass one zero two four on zero f comma mag dot max zero point one f comma multi multi into m base ratio semicolon now here I will say zoom text view dot set text size m ratio plus now if I run the application and let's see what happens. Now the app is running on the device. Let's pinch it. Now it is not working. So let's see the code if we have any problem in it. Now the first thing is we will return here true and the second thing I noticed this will be on touch event. Now if I run the application again and let's see if it is working. Let's open the 
Now the app is running. Let's pinch it. Now it is working. And now zoom out it. So that's all for this tutorial. So we have learned uh, to create pinch zoom text view and Android. So please like and subscribe my channel uh, so that I can make more videos like this and uh, my viewership can grow. Uh, thank you.